in that season, when my dad left, it was, my mom raised three of us, and we went through like rough times. Um, we almost lost our home. We, we were like low on, on food, low on finances. And God would, would use through my mother's prayers, like our neighbors to actually help bring food and bring clothing to us. And I was just like, and in, in, in my wrestle with God, like, why would this happen? And, and, and why is it happening to us specifically, me specifically? Um, as I was processing the whole thing, I would see God move. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, okay, so this happened, but God is still providing. This happened, but God is still present. And uh, that started to draw my heart. And, uh, and around middle school is when it kind of like flipped the switch. Because, you know, I, I'm, I, was, I was getting discipled around that time. So I was just like, okay, God is real. I know God loves me, you know what I'm saying? And, mm-hmm. and, and, and I'm still trying to understand what his plan is for my life. So I did go in a couple bumps on the road, um, you know what I'm saying, with a whole bunch of, like, just bad company. You know what I'm saying? Not bad yeah. company. People who made bad decisions. Um, I would often be amongst them, um, not always doing what they did, but often, like, in fights and, you know what I'm saying, just, yeah. like, trying to be the tough guy. And, and uh, the Lord really snatched me up from that because I remember – I think it was seventh grade. I had a buddy of mine. He started selling cocaine um, in middle school, Dang. which is crazy. You know what I'm saying? Like, that is like, what? Maybe that's the, that Miami. <laughs> Man, I was just thinking about it the other day. I'm like, that is a very is crazy. Young unique age. experience. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, especially unless, yeah, I've told in that, like, the Lord was kind of like, this is what I'm going to save you from. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? And, and in that same season, um, the Lord was just drawing my heart and convicting me. You know what I'm saying? Because I was in the midst of a, of a group of friends. I used to love to fight. I used to love to, like, prove myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was, like, that dude. And, uh, man, the Lord started convicting me. <laughs> it just, like, uh, I put you in the midst of all these, all these people, and, and I want you to, to, to be a light for them. 